Kentucky State Police are investigating a fatal fire in Spencer County that's near the Shelby County line. WLKY was on the scene moments after the fire broke out in a home on Airport Road. WLKY Steve Bergen talked to a man who stopped and tried to help. Steve joins us now live. Steve? Rick, while the coroner has not released the victim's name, neighbors tell us the home belongs to a UPS captain and his wife. This cell phone video was shot by WLKY photographer Paul Landers around 9 a.m. A neighbor told us he heard an explosion before flames engulfed the two story house. Alton Logan was driving by just as the fire started. And I looked over the scene. I thought it was, thought it was clouds, it was smoke. You know, then I realized it was a fire, and I come up the hill. And when I came up the hill, you, you know, it started smoke was coming out the windows, and had flames hadn't came out yet. Loden jumped out of his truck, but because the fire was so intense in the front, he headed to the back door. He was unable to arouse anyone inside. We later learned a son was in Arizona and a daughter in Tennessee. A close friend tried for hours to reach their parents. She eventually did reach the mother. Meanwhile, the Taylorsville Spencer County Fire Department turned over the scene to Kentucky State Police. Several investigators checked the family's hangar and family vehicles. The home is located near a landing strip. Loden says before he knew it, flames were everywhere. By the time I got back around, flames was coming out the side window up here. Uh, you know, it was always pouring out of it and out the front and everything. And the dumb melt at the bleed, uh, the banisters and everything on the front steps. I mean, it was, like I say, it was, from time I got here, within probably five minutes, I mean, it was it was almost pretty much gone. Crime tape went up in a front room of what was left of the house. A man's body was found inside. KSP and the Spencer County Coroner's Office confirmed the death. Now, we aren't likely to get the victim's name until sometime tomorrow after an autopsy is performed. State police are not releasing any additional information on their investigation. Two family dogs were unhurt. They were taken to a veterinarian. Steve